it'll pay off eventually. So, <laughs> yeah, oh my god. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, oh, oh. You love show. Lie down. My name is Nadim, and as a show host in China, I've shadowed people from different walks of life to know more about their work. Rural doctors, forest rangers, and poverty alleviation officials. Now, I want to challenge myself and learn a new trade, for real this time. So I've decided to become a Jingju apprentice. But there's a catch. I only have 100 days to learn an art that takes years to master. This is my journey to the Jingju stage. In a bit, here we go. Safety first. Today, today is the, the last re rehearsal, right? Yeah, the last rehearsal, yeah. I am very excited. Um, not nervous, but a little bit scared because today is a dress rehearsal. So basically, I'm going to be trying my outfit for the first time. I'm going to be putting on makeup and I... <laughs> they're gonna put the late hole, yeah. which is not something to be looking forward to because it is extremely painful. Wow. Um, on day one, when we were in the car, if there's one thing that I would have told myself, it would have been, be patient. I think that I learned this lesson the hard way through my injury, through um, my sometimes disappointment in myself, in my frustration for not getting the moves right. And so, <laughs> I would, I would definitely say, just be more patient because it, it'll pay off eventually. So, <laughs> yeah, oh my God. <laughs> oh, emotional, I hate it. Ah. Uh, yeah. Here we go. I, I felt incredibly good today before getting on stage. Previously, when we were doing the evaluation or other rehearsals, I was a little bit worried, I was a little bit nervous, but today, I, I don't know what happened. I don't know if the gods of Peking Opera were satisfied with me, but there was this sense of really calm and really just like ease. And so I'm very satisfied and I'm really happy that I get to show what the past 100 days have done to me on stage. Today,这个任务呢,一半也是为了帮助他吧。通过这个戏呢,能够帮我这点经历呢,让他知道怎么来的。如果京剧都是这个地方剪一点,那个地方功夫上不去,这个戏就完了。京剧在这里戏都是一个戏就这个路子但人眼科就不一样这个戏呢作为我们国家京剧院代表剧目多年的代表剧目武戏我们讲究武戏就是非常肯定的吧内行外行都觉得是一个非常成熟这个成功改个成功的剧目你好你好你好谢谢你今天你来非常感谢谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢谢你谢
，苏联芭蕾舞团，嗯哼，两位男演员，嗯，到中国来，他们那个团到中国来演出，他跟我们的老师张云熙、张中华老师学的三岔口，嗯，我我是他的老师，这出戏是我的老师，他们创作的。完全不同于过去的内容，待会儿我再跟你聊一聊。好，好，好，好，好，好，好，好，谢谢你。So when I was putting the outfit, and it was the first time that I put the outfit before I had put the harness and I had put the big belt, but it wasn't as tight as it was today. Today, well, today it was really, really like jean, very tight, very taut. There's this inner drive in you that this is not who I am. This is I'm someone different. I'm, I'm for for Yu Lao Shi, it's. Liu Li Hua. For me, it's Ren Tang Hui, and so you just your character becomes alive. You become your character, and and I think it's it's an amazing transformation that happens like this. It happens so fast. Thank you. 